together they have to communicate. It doesn't matter what you feel, but you know, that's an important interaction between the viewers and the painting. When I go to looking at the landscape, I, I, sometimes I look for specific feelings for my work. Your feeling has to be more relaxed. And when I do painting, my character or all my aspects going to come out anyway, whatever I paint. So that, you know, that painting is a me. So people, when people looking at it, that's, that's where they feel the same, maybe. I like to use the, um, that underpainting technique that the old master, master's been using it, so. I, I like that, you know, technique of the drip, drippings and, and then when you paint, you know, you know thin layers of colors, different colors, then you can, you'll be able to create a really deeper sense of feelings. I've been trying d using different colors and new composition compared to the, my previous work. I'm mean, still the same landscape, but um, I'm sort of looking at the more in a vast area of the skies and clouds, and I'm adding into more different colors. So I use a lot of whites, some creamy, creamy colors, a lot of blues, like a cool blues or warm blues or turquoise. And I think, yeah, that's at the moment I'm sort of looking at the dif different aspect of my landscape. So I, I guess um, it became a lot, lot lighter in terms of in terms of the colors, and um, still lot, I still lot, use a lot of textures using impasto. Sometimes I use cracking mediums to try try to make the my work a bit antique in a sense because um, my work actually de dealing with um, the concept of you know impermanence of the time and fragility of memories, in a sense. The most important thing is actually the process of the painting itself. That's where I get a lot of enjoyment out of doing it. Focusing on the, the clouds, yeah. it actually there's a... Um, this is, you know, the, the concept of ephemerality or impermanence there. So that that's another um, aspect of my work that, you know, the clouds, every moment they're sort of moving and changing and um, sometimes they just disappear really quickly. And sometimes, you know, looking at the sunset, looking at the colors, that sort of really quick moving of the passing times, that passing of the you know, feeling is, is moved so quickly that interests me a, as a visually, you know. Also, the, you, you, when you're looking at it, looking at the sky, that you, your feeling changes as well. And humans' moods are changeable by nature. So that's what I'm trying to do, you know, in my painting speaks itself about the feeling and that's where the, the if the viewers feel the same or different way that's important as well because they together they have to communicate it doesn't matter what you feel but you know that's the important interaction between the viewers and the painting